Hello everyone, and welcome to another Howler for an Hour. This is Amadama, and this game really caught my attention. It has a really interesting visual style. This is basically a samurai action game that's kind of sandboxy, and what caught my attention with this was originally the trailer, but then I noticed who was responsible. Look at the bottom there. Uh, the main developer is uh, Izanagi Games Incorporated, but Acquire Corp is also part of this. And that's very interesting. If you don't know Acquire Corp, they're actually the creators of the Tenchu Stealth Assassins games, as well as the Way of the Samurai games. This game seems to be something like the Way of the Samurai games, kind of a samurai sa sandboxy game. Those games that Acquire made back in the day, especially, very good games. Very, very good ninja-y samurai stuff that came, that came out of X Studio. So to see them involved in the production of Amidama very much interests me. I think this game's going to be good, but we'll have to find out. That's the whole point of Halo for now. So, before we begin, if you like the video, do think about giving it a like. If you haven't subscribed yet, you can think about doing that as well. But if you really want to help out, think about coming over to Twitch. I'm trying to reach a partner, but of course, we need more viewers to do that. So if you want to come by, whether to lurk or talk, think about doing so. So it does help out, and we would honestly love to have you. We also have a pretty cool Discord community if you want to check that out. I have a coffee link if you want to help directly monetize my content. And I have a merch store if you want to buy some cool stuff. Links in the description you can check them out at your leisure. Ah, Tenshu. I'm glad there's at least one person in the chat that knows what I'm talking about when I say Tenshu and Way of the Samurai. Because those games were freaking good. Alright? So if Acquire Corp's at all involved in this project, that's a good sign because this game has similar vibes to those games. So... Let's hop into this. And uh, again, let me know if the volume is good, stream goers, as we start up. Actually, how loud is this menu sound? Should I turn it down a little bit? Sounds a little loud on my end, but... It'll turn down a little bit. That's probably fine. Let's try that. New game. Well, oh no, my autosave data that I don't have will be overwritten. Okay. あまいとの白きと愛の空というのごとく果敢な死命なれど集いて流れることは絶えぬさみだれの命を Okay, I'm already liking these vibes. Okiはえどのすれ のきにたまった薄いのごとく I don't want to interrupt this guy. He's he's I love the I love I love his tone. I hamano hazre no bangasayano nakamutsumaji chodaiga Ichinichi no shigoto e yasmo to shiteori mashita. I love the melodrama. You know, it sets the tone perfectly for storytelling. 
Okay, so Brother Fish, uh, sister, just finished the day's work at an umbrella shop, and that's where our story begins. Hello, Zabachi. Hey, you, you came by at a good time. We just started a game I'm really in intrigued by. So, I'd like to note, look, look at this art style. It's like 3D, but also 2D. It kind of almost feels like something you, you could make on the PS1. It has almost it has a PS1 vibe, but like a really it, odd PS1 vibe. It's got that like 3D 2D mix kind of vibe. Huh. I tell you, all this rain is good for business. The umbrellas are flying off the shelves today. Oh, I should probably close the door. It sounds like you got a little bit of a bit of a breeze going on in the shop. Hmm? Should I remove my talking head for this one if we're gonna have people on the right? Hmm. Maybe I will. Yes. That reminds me. I promised I'd mend yours, didn't I? What's wrong with it? What's wrong with it? Let me take a look. So anybody joining just now, this game is partially developed by AcquireCore, which are which is the studio responsible for the, the old PS1 Tenchu Stealth Assassin games, as well as the Way of the Samurai games, which I believe were on PS2, maybe GameCube. Very, very good samurai and ninja games. Excellent games. So to see them involved with this project is a very good sign. Liking the model work. Like this low res, but like very well animated. I'll have this patched up in no time. Let's see. I was a little surprised seeing this game because I haven't heard of Acquire Core doing things. Like <laughs> I, they have been around still, but I just haven't been really aware of what they've been doing lately. But yeah, they're responsible, partially responsible for this game. So there, good as new. I wonder if Yui can't speak. It seems like she's mute, but her umbrella is good. Hmm? Who goes there? Oh, hi. Who are you? <coughs> Yui, this way. One second. Okay, why are there assassins coming to attack us? We're just umbrella sellers. Oh, okay. Well, that, that works. <laughs> Then in the end, we look an awful lot like Sarah for an umbrella seller. <clears throat> what do they want with us? They offer blood. I've learned the Utsetsu Tensei sword style from Master Muyo. Don't worry, Yui. Whatever happens, I'll protect you. I don't know, come... Okay, let's see. Move the left stick, run... Left trigger, left stick, jump, A button, light and heavy, X and block. Okay. Block of LB. Okay. Hold it. Evade of RB. Block plus evade, LB, hold, and left stick. Okay. Switch target RT. Okay. Target enemy from behind could draw a lot of blood and inflict more damage than a normal attack. On the other hand, if you should hit from behind, You'll take more damage as well. That'll play close to where you're standing. So position is very key. Alright. And I have a stab in the meter. Alright. We do have play we have like beat him up planes too. I can move up and down. So. Okay, okay. All right, feels pretty good so far. <laughs> Try and cut me down. With my Utsetsu Tensei technique, Misty rep Riposte, I'll drive off all your attacks and send them back at you. I should maybe try the whole... Yeah, I'm gonna guess there's a counter system. Let's see here. Misty Riposte. Okay. By repelling attack, you receive Volgari. You can then return the enemies and take the back at against them. They say this move is quiet like a misty rain, but look what it has in store. You receive an enemy attack while guarding, holding LB. 
button icon will appear overhead. This icon will tell you there's time to connect the mystery bus. But after a certain amount of time, it will disappear. Yep. Okay. Icon displayed above the head of your current target during combat. Oh, yeah. Okay. Sorry, he's just Okay. Okay. I see! That is very powerful. Of course, I gotta have the stamina for it. I notice I drain stamina constantly as I guard, so I gotta make sure I guard when I need to. Very anime. Very much so. This game... This game's gonna have the cool fights and stuff. Uh-oh. Yui! Anime in a good way, yeah. Stop! Don't you dare lay your finger on her. Let her go. Well, that was a short game. <laughs> Yui. Yui does seem to be mute. She's not said a word. She seems to be our sister. She seems to be. She hasn't said a word, so she's probably mute. Or something like that. Pretty solid intro. Amidama. Yep, that's the game. Thanks for coming, guys. Now the credits will roll. By the way, if you're wondering why my talking head is gone, it's because character portraits can appear in the lower right. I'll just leave my head off for now. But yet, we are still a spirit. What the? <clears throat> Is that my body? I must be dead. I couldn't protect her. If only I was stronger. Forgive me, Yui. In the end, I was powerless. can't help you now that I'm... Wait, if I'm already dead, why can I still move? Thanks to Buddha. He helped you. He's a cool guy. Hmm? Did that statue stop my soul departing? That's nice of it. It's all that's left of me, though. My soul. I'm fully conscious. I can move around. That's about all I can do. If only I had a body. Yes. Hold on. If I shift, can shift my soul to another body, maybe I'd be able to control it. Frog. That's a weird frog noise. Stop splashing in my blood, frog. Or is that somebody else's blood? I don't know. Shull shift shifting. Shull shut targets while in soul form with the X or Y button. Shut the targets with fate. Move close to a fate target and hold RT to soul shift to their body. When you approach a body, you control shift too. You can check to see how your stats would change after shifting to the new body. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> Pow. You ever just get body checked by a soul? <laughs> Ow. <laughs> I suppose I'll have to make do with a frog's body. I was expecting the portrait art to change, but that does make sense. That portrait art, my goodness. That wide heckin' face. What am I saying? All that matters is saving Yui. <gasps> oh, you poor young thing. Shift your soul to those living in this world. Put them into action and change your sad fate. If you wish to find what you seek, remember this. Life is a precious thing. Every time you kill, the light of your soul will fade. Ah. Defeating foes diminishes your soul glow. When your soul glow is extinguished, 
you will no longer be able to control your current body. Oh, that makes... Okay, okay. Can't just stay in one really powerful form. Soul shifting to a different body will restore your soul glow. Okay. That's a good mechanic. Hang in there, Yui. I'm coming to get you. That's a promise. So sadly, that means I can't stay in the ultra-powerful frog form forever. Your HP focus is soul gauge or so at the top left of the screen. So HP focus is basically a stamina system, effectively. Okay. Check your career soul glow in the top right corner of the screen. Arrow in the case direction of your current objective. Hold RT while controlling the body and shift back to soul form. You cannot shift back to soul form during combat. Okay. Left stick while holding LT to move. Move quickly to change focus. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. Avoid staying your soul or the like. Yeah. Hmm. But yeah, what do you guys think of the art style? Like, look at this environment. We have, like, this really crispy pixel art of stones, and then we got this really pixie, pixely, but, like, really high, high detail stone floor and, like, the reflective lights and stuff, and then we got the water in the background. I really like the art style. I think the art style really stands out. It's unique. Remember I was just talking about with the previous game? How I feel like a lot of games are just using art pack assets, and that's fine, but I really prefer it when a game has its own style, it develops itself by having unique assets. This game is a perfect example of that. Like, this this feels like itself, you know? Anyway, so let's head over to Tenement Lane. Okay. Hmm. I recognize those men. They're locals. I wonder what they're talking about. Oh no, it's a it's it's a puppo. Hmm. Easy now. There's a good there's a good boy. Wait, does he think I'm on the menu? Probably. I don't want to end up this dog's dinner. I don't like my chances, but I've got to fight. How do, how do we frog fight exactly? Frogs and dogs in block two. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Yes! <laughs> Lily pad. That's amazing. Oh. What? Okay. Maybe I held it too long. Oh no. <laughs> we had to kill the dog, I'm sorry. Phew. Not quite sure I managed that. If any luck, I'll be able to hear what those men are saying now. If foes are left on the verge of death, you can directly soul shift to, to a target of the state. When you leave an area and remain defeated, foes will return to original positions. Soul shift to targets who have fainted or are on the verge of death by holding RT, even if when you're already controlling your body, so you can quickly switch, too. Well, obviously, this is kind of an awkward thing, because sad thing is I killed a dog. Good thing is I could be a dog now. Big spank. Hmm. 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 Eh. Worried commoner. All that commotion last night, and no sign of those two cents. Mm. Son of a destitute samurai and his mute sister. Can't say I'm surprised. I've heard here say that she was adopt adopted. It appears the umbrella seller found her when she was just a baby. Uh. Toko's speaking ill of them like that. You know what I appreciate? These are just some NPCs, but they each have different portrait art. I mean, one's just a modified version of the other, but that's still very much appreciated. We've got the lad and his umbrellas to thank for keeping the rain off our heads. Mm. I suppose you're right. You know, I heard there, there, some of those louts from the gambling den were skulking about the place. Apparently they slunk off to Shibu Shibu Shikuba after that. Took the girl with him, by all accounts. Huh. Murky business, that's for sure. Sounds like they might have had a run with a Bakado. Bakudo? No surprise. Seems like they could barely make ends meet. Whatever it is, I just hope they wind up safe. Ah, uh ah. -huh. I reckon they're just lying low for a spell. They'll be back soon enough. You'll see. Mm. <laughs> yeah, we're cute. Are they talking about me and Yui? I wish I could speak to townsfolk. This is such a mixed blessing. If dogs are great, but we have to murder them to be them. <laughs> That's sad. <laughs> well, soul form, or controlling a frog or dog. You're unable to talk to people. For this, you need to be controlling a human body. However, you can't simply show something to a human straight away. Yes. I don't have much time, though. I need to be looking for my sister. I won't make much headway if I can't speak with anyone. I need to find someone to shift my soul to. Anyway, it looks like they took Yui to Sh Shukuba. Okay. 
Is that the way to Shikuba? So, I can... so what can we do? Let's bite. That's another bite. Okay, the, the attacks seem to be the same. You can also run. Fast, 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 fast. What's our block look like in this? Oh, whoop, that's not what I meant to do. <laughs> Hold on a second. I guess you can only block in combat, so I can't actually find out. Because, like, Frog pulled out Lily Pad. How does Dog block, though? I'm really intrigued by that. Okay, so Shakuba's over there. What is to the right, though? Because I like to do things out of order. I guess I could just straight up attack the commoners, but... Seems like a bad idea, probably. Okay, that's far as we do. It, LB doesn't, it's not, doesn't seem to be working outside of combat, though. I mean, I could go bite the commoner, but they seem like decent people. This feels like a... This is a sandbox, so I don't want to just, like, attack everyone. There's probably people that I'm like, oh. I mean, like, if I want to take over their body, I guess so, but, like, yeah. <gasps> Abakudo. Hmm. Just like the men who attacked us. I must be in league with the scum who took Yui. He wandered off towards the bridge. I better follow him. I wonder what the talk button is when I can talk. Ooh. Hey, plus 20. Hold on a second. Oh, here's our menu. Soul level 1, XP till next level. Oh, there is an exp so there is an RPG system to this. Um... Oh, we can actually see the stats for each animal, too. A stray dog has started living in the tenements, always hungry and looking for food. When it spots a frog, it's on it in a flash. <laughs> you see the direct, the specific damage of the form. This is very good. This is very good how this is laid out. And uh, we're picking up items as well. So what's this chart? Oh, no. The Ki the Kirikumo clan, day one noon. I woke up with just my soul intact. You just know what I've seen. Just a human body. See what I can find out. I'm noticing times. Chart. There's multiple ways this this game can play out, isn't there? Branching paths. And it might be based on how quickly I do things. There might be, like, a time system. Oh, okay, here's the map. Okay. A pleasure quarter over there. Uh, okay, okay. I wonder if time advances naturally or if time advances when events happen. Yes, the chart is really cool. That means if you could you could replay the game and try different things. This seems really well made, actually. And then we have records of like everything I find. General says foes felled as a frog, <laughs> so you can look up little details. That's kind of cool. Save any time. You revisit the. You can look at the tutorial stuff again if you need to. That's very good. The only thing I don't know is what that thing I just picked up. It says plus 20. Does that mean I have gained strength with this doggy form? I don't see a time measure on the screen, so I'm thinking time probably advances based on... Time probably advances based on events and not based on time. Huh. They should fall after that Bakudo. They must have headed to the bridge. Either that or I'm still in the tutorial stage, so time's not advancing normally. It's one or the other. I'll try to play a good playthrough. I'm not going to just attack everyone. I want to attack the bad people. I ideally. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a good boy right now. I have to be, I have to be a good boy. Not just attack anybody. Health and stuff. Yeah, maybe so. There does seem to be a currency system, so I will break pots trying to look for money. Hello. Uh, I can't talk in this state. For that, I'll need a human body. <laughs> Starving elder. So hungry. Did he just... Okay. Well. Can barely move. Need to eat. Seems like that old man's on his last legs. Maybe I can shift my soul to him. Good town. We just have the elders die in the streets. Hold our teeth next to a faint target on the target of the verge of death. Still shit. Okay. I mean, if he's not using that body anymore. 
Admittedly, I'm a little disappointed that I didn't have much time as Doggo. We'll have to do Doggo stuff later. Omicron? I don't know what that is. Actually, man, I should shift to someone. This old body is hard to move. Guess I can't complain. I should be able to speak to people now. I can display above characters you can speak to. Approach them and press the B button to converse. Oops. My cut is displayed above targets you can soul shift to. Kick or soul shift them to knock them out before soul shifting. Ah, okay. So I have to pay attention to that mark. My cut above targets you have yet to soul shift to will include a green mark. Oh, okay. It's a Pokedex thing. I gotta shul I gotta shul shift into the mall. So there's a little mark that lets me know if that's something I've never if that's a type of character I haven't shifted into. With some exceptions, you can't soul shift to targets you've not yet defeated. Additionally, you are unable to soul shift to the foes you've already defeated while they have their weapon drawn and are on high alert. Okay. <laughs> Look at my little run. Go shuffle. All right. So how do I how to, how talk? Gotta be careful about the yeah. Oh, ah. it's it's the B button. Okay. Don't let me see you making a nuisance of yourself. Makes me think of Guy Six said not bad. What are these games you talk about oh, that are just bad? Huh? Trying to cross the bridge, are we? There's a toll to pay. You know what? Let's just get right to the point. Did you attack the umbrella shop? Umbrella shop? What are you talking about? Why'd I go and do a thing like that? I don't know why. We ain't in the business of breaking the shops. What do you take us for? Two bit criminals? You are trying to pay, make me pay a toll, so yes. Where'd you take the girl? Huh? What? You're accusing us of abducting some kid? Try saying that again, I'll see see what happens. The Bakuda of uh, Ahama ain't a bunch of damn kidnappers. They ain't planned to cross. Stop wasting my damn time. You know anything about the Masked Man? Ah. Masked Man? Nah, not a clue. Look, I've had it up to here of you. We ain't kidnappers. Get that through your thick skull. Bad it's though? That's another story. They've been taking around taking taking folks around these parts lately. One of them wanted one of them's a wanted man. Sounds like the type to go around wearing a mask, if you ask me. Right, that's enough. Go on scram. I got work to do. Hmm. So it's the bandits who've been abducting people. The masked men took you, he must be one of them. Now that I can speak to people, I should head back to Shuku Shukuba and ask around. Omicron's an old game where you possess and kill various people. Stop eating the creature. The Omicron world. You know, this also reminds me, wasn't there like this weird Amiga game that also was like, you, you possess robots, between, you live between robots and a ship that you're trying to like, stop from blowing up or something? I don't remember exactly. Shuffle! I shall have to leave the dog behind, sadly. I'm sure we can find another one. Okay, so look, time just advanced, so I think it's event-based. That pretty much proves it. Whoa, did you see how fast we shuffle on screen? Wait, give that back. Hmm? Are those bandits just now? I should see what the merchant has to say. I think I have seen Omicron. It sounds slightly familiar. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Uh, Big store boss. <laughs> my merchandise! Uh, I'm supposed to make the sale today. What's my client going to say? Curse those bandits. Uh, I will take this line down. Machete time! Hello. Ah! Uh. What are you gopping at? This isn't the theater. I'm looking for the bandits too. Uh -huh. Hold on, you got a bone to pick with those brigands as well? Far too many of them for me to handle. If only some brave fellow would teach them a lesson. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Looks like the bandits headed off in that direction. I'm very frail. Can I do it? I feel like I have better chance with the dog. Sweet, which there's a dog. To great lengths to pro procure that parcel for my client. Part of giving folks troubles is the bad is a joy. I wonder what the parcel was. Sounds important. Wait, hold on. This guy, this person is like trying to weigh me down. Hello. 
Hello! Our soap is a cut above the rest. You can taste the difference. Oh, okay. Oh, look at that artwork. I like that. Kake Sobe. I don't have money, though, so... That's nice. Mm. I'm back soon. Uh, what do you do? Yeah. When your tummy's full, you're twice as strong. A nice meal waits inside. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, so the green mark indicates I've been that, I guess. Okay. I'll go inside and we'll see who's in here. Hello. Oh, Tanuki. Welcome, welcome. How about a tipple? Oh, baby, a tipple. That was a terrible joke. <laughs> I do like the little pixel art for the food, though. That's cool. Ah. Even already? Till next time, then. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Do that in general. Dumbercrow is a fourth choice toward the end, where you actually kill some innocent people, take control of their body, and progress. In the general, the end of the game, most of the people you do have a general evil dirt bakes. So that's kind of annoying that you have the choice throughout the entirety of that game, and then at the end, it's just like, yeah, kill an innocent person. Hell yeah! Who needs restaurant food when you got. when you got. Pot food, I don't know. <laughs> pot, pot food is just as good. I'm kind of curious, is that just an immediate... I guess that's just an immediate heal. I don't seem to have an inventory. I was wondering if this was going into an inventory or something. Hopefully money could drop for those pots. That's why I'm beating them up. Traditional Tanuki. One of those uh, statues. Ooh. Grand robber. Ooh, grand. What are you looking at? State your business. Hmm. You work for the masked man. Masked man, I ain't got a clue what you're talking about. Even if it did, why'd I go running off why'd I go running my mouth off to a nobody like you? Stow it. We don't have the we don't have the time. You can go over the robber. Oh yes, he's the boss. Deal with this. Looks like fine is the only option. Fortunately, I have a- I do have a knife. <laughs> different stances come with different soul specialisms. Soul specialisms can be activated by pressing the B and Y buttons at the same time. It drains your soul gauge. Okay, okay. Let's check what soul specialisms you have. Use RA to select soul specialists for the mini. Alright. One moment. I don't want them together, I want them separate. There we go. The f priest, rivet old man. I'm, I'm, I'm nowhere near you. Why are you attacking like that? <laughs> they have slow reaction times, don't they? Monies. I like that bunny. Oh, never mind. I don't get that bunny. <laughs> I leveled. I just realized this art style makes me think of dead cells. Really? Oh, yeah. Similar tech. Belt. It might be a similar tech. Yeah, I could see that. I bet it from before it seemed like you might know something. I need to catch up with them. Can shift to this knocked out bandit. That should make me stronger. Knocked out. Yes, I guess that's a way to put it. Speed mm. foes rewards your VIX speed. Gain enough speed, you'll level up. Level it up, increase your maximum HP and focus. Drop money is picked up automatically when you walk by. Yep. Oh, the money's still there. That's nice. The cut. I thought the cutscene would remove it. That guy gives me a little bit more to work with. Oh, this guy has more attack power for less. What do those stats mean? Hold on, wait. These guys are not equal. They have different stats. Let me compare something. So, HP, focus, attack, and defense. This guy has less focus, but more attack. Way more attack. And a little more defense. I'm gonna pick him. There we go. <laughs> I like that when I leave a body, that just leaves a zombie. 
that just leaves a husk standing there. Mildly creepy, but okay. So. It's rare for a scene not to leak, to leak collectibles, plus three points. I agree, that was very well thought out. I hope they're not necessarily dead. I don't know what they are at this point. Hello. Oh! Sorry, it isn't more. Oh, don't apologize, Vigarl. Thank you for the $10. That makes a difference. Thank you so much for that. Also, welcome. I don't think I've seen you around before. Or the few girls have indentured themselves as harlots. They do it for the immediate payout. Oi. Oi. Money I lend must be repaid properly and precisely. Mm. I'm on my way. I'm on patrol. Welcome, welcome. You name it, we got it. What you got? Do you have a Game Boy Advance? You don't have that. I named it, though. You should have it. Uh, let's see. It's got some mochi. Often even for Children's Day. Oh, yeah, that's, that's actually true. But the leaf is not to be consumed. No, it's just the wrapping. Okay, got some healing cell. I assume anything I buy is immediately used. And I don't I don't think there's an inventory ah. system. All right, what do you have? Oh, look at this guy. He looks he looks intense. Freshly fried. No word of a lie. What'll it be? Oh, it's a Pura. Man, Tapura's good. Who's squid Tapura? Conger eel. I don't even know what the conger eel is. Oh. You ought to be up to something. I am upside. It's kicking this pot. I did it. I'm up to something. Mm. Dojo hot pot towel. I'll make a fight on empty stomach. Stop by our place to buy a bite to eat. I'll look at your hot pot. I'm not buying anything. I just want to look at the food pictures. Hi, courier. Can't talk to them. Yeah. Hot pot. Hot pots are good. Money picked up multiplied by 1.2. Huh. For how long that effects last. Okay, so we got some proper mills actually have like... I can't even afford those, but that's kind of interesting. Time travels quickly. It does? So I'll be down by the other game. Well, that's if I take out our buddies about. I'm gonna try to try to be a good guy on this playthrough. Hey there, wrestler. I think I managed to give him the slip. Huh? Only you? Where are the others? Oh, I I thought I could play along, like, oh yeah, boss. No, I can't. I have to just uh Tell me about the kidnappers. You acted strange. So tell me you're a damn turncoat. Yep. <laughs> We, no option to even be sneaky about it. Fight formidable foes. Right, certain fights formidable foes. Your opponent's HP bar. Oh, he's a boss. Oh yeah, boss music. Okay. Let's see then. I'm gonna separate them out. Looks like powerful swings too. I'm like I'm trying I'm trying to encourage him to split up a little bit. And a fast combo seems pretty effective. Whoosh. I don't mind my focus. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh god. Holy shit. <laughs> One combo and I'm here almost dead. Alright. Oh, there's a pot over here. I have an idea. Dang. Oh, now they're empty. Okay, that's better. Yeah, he has some deceptively fast sack swings, actually. Oh, 
Drop more money. Ice cream required. Nicely done. Oh. Say so I don't sneak. No, we just fight. <laughs> How did this happen? Tell me about the kidnappings in general. You're asking the wrong person. They've got nothing to do with me. You had orders from the boss. Round up as many girls as you can find. Oh, that sounds horrible. What the hell is that about? That music was good, by the way. Good boss music. Right up as many girls as you can find. For what? Mm -hmm. Guess they didn't know anything about Yui. Still, he admitted they're involved in other kidnappings. Bitch, it's not about a boss, though. Are these bandits more organizing the look? Or the point? Where on earth is she? Oh. Curses, where have my merchandise gone to? Mm, that box. Perchance. Oh. My parcel, there's no doubt about it. I have my merchandise safe. What a relief. Let's try and have it explain this to my client. With my eternal gratitude. It's not much, but I'd like you to have this. What'd I get? Ah. If there's anything else I can do, just say the word. Oh, it's a buddy. Okay. Um. You call that a reward? No, it's fine. I'll be polite. <laughs> Kidnapped. Such awful business. I'll say I'd be in much use, though. Yeah, yeah. The Lord's estate is in the heart of the Samurai Quarter. How about seeing what the, his men could do for you? For you? I dare say Ahim Hama's retainers might be privy to what's going on. That's all. Could be right. The retainers ought to know something about the kidnappings. This route should lead to the Samurai Quarter. That's where the Lord's estate is. Hi, hi. Forgive me, I can't keep my customer waiting forever. This is where I take my leave. Sacrificial gatherings. Yeah, that's the vibe I get. Ah. Or something more creepy. Oh, here's a word of advice. I'm quite the regular at this here, Soba, yeah. Ah. The temporary Soba is just scrumptious. Please try it if you're so inclined. <laughs> Thanks for rescuing my package from the bandits. Also, you should really try this restaurant. It's a bit pricey, but the reward I just gave you should suffice. And you well keeps your body healthy and strong. Now, farewell, friend. Whoosh. I've never eaten Terpura soba before. Ah, well, you should. You're missing out. Anything with Terpura related is generally good. It's been nonstop fighting. Maybe I should head into that soba yeah, before heading to the samurai quarter. I assume that. Yeah. Oh, wow. This guy is, like, way better than me. Oh, no. Where's all. Oh, you know what? I bet I got. So somebody shot out of him. I think I got it. It probably got it, gave it to me automatically because the cutscene started right after that. So I, I assume I got the money. Oh, oh it's no, it's right here. Alright, yeah, that works. I never eaten Tapura soba before. I'm gonna stop in that soba, yeah. Okay. Okay, it's a forced decision thing. Alright, again, glad that the game isn't making me just miss stuff. I can go pick it up later. Just appreciate it. Starving Elder, if you want some food. <laughs> He's just hanging in the restaurant starving when it's a food. Slipped out a bowl of our splendid soba. Handmade, of course. What is soba? So any food purchased in restaurants itself is strictly your current body. Consume a mix of spe a special mix of food to activate food combinations and bring you even greater enhancements. Oh. The foods and food combinations you have already discovered are listed in your rack. So if I eat multiple things, I might get a combination. Okay. Yes, uh, soba is just... Let's see. Taka soba, crown of big juicy tempura prawn. Better slather it on extra six so it tastes crispy and delicious even as it absorbs the broth. Also, I'm not allowed to pick anything else. I think soba is a type of broth dish. Noodles? Yeah, soba noodles. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Also, it's forced me to eat this, so I guess I'll eat it. Defense plus 40, HP 40% 40 of max. It does sound pretty good. I mean, we did almost die to one combo. Oh my gosh. That E animation is great. <laughs> you know what that means, right? There's an e, there's probably an E animation for every character. I mean, obviously, they probably use the same animation, but still, that's kind of neat. Let's see again. Honestly, I'm happy to try anything once. Yes. 
Okay, now I'm off to the samurai quarter. That's where the Lord's estate lies. The entertainers ought to know something about the kidnappings. I like how we're just gonna walk in the Lord's estate as like a head bandit person. I'm sure that'll go well. Oh, something. Look at this. This is kind of weird. Look at this. I am behind. Get in front of this person. Hmm. That person has something wrong with their, like, layering. <laughs> So mostly this game seems to take place over the course of like, what is that, a week? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then light, light and shadow, which is like the conclusion, I guess. So this is probably a game you can play multiple times, get multiple paths, etc. I'll try to save the vanilla path for this playthrough. Kick. So what do you guys think of this game so far? I mean, we're we're going through tutorial stuff. This is a extended. What we're playing right now is effectively kind of an extended tutorial, but it does seem very interesting. Ah. Hmm. You seem important. This, these days it's soba this, soba that. Where's the love for udon? I like udon. Katsune and udon, I'd eat that. Kake udon topped with a salty sweet sliver of fried tofu. Foxes, katsune, are said to be especially fond of the fried tofu topping, hence the name. Ooh, tanuki udon as well. Kake udon topped with a generous heap of fried batter bits. I'm guessing that's just fried breading, but it sounds nice. There's nothing better for bat than ba there's nothing better than batter for being the great rainy season blues. That almost feels like mm. a rhyme. Yum, katsune. <laughs> exactly. Fox, fox, fox! Yay! Hmm, mm. this ought to be the Lord's estate. Where is everyone, though? Doesn't look like I can get inside. Oh. Oi. Keep it moving, traitor. Oh, who's this guy? <laughs> you fools if you thought I'd give you an easy time. <laughs> Stubborn wretch! You, over there, stop the traitor! <laughs> Not in my life. I'll have my freedom if I have to cut you down for it. Oh, you you arrested him, but let, gave, let him keep his greatsword. All right, sure. <laughs> sure, got it. Fight alongside allies. During some fights, you'll find yourself fighting along NPC allies. Allies cannot hurt you during combat, nor will you attack your effects affect them. Okay. Allies cannot die, but can lose their ability to fight. Okay. Sorry, being captured would be too much of an inconvenience. I guess that is inconvenient. I'm more worried about getting caught in crossfire here, though. Not for the guards, but... He's swinging very randomly because of all the guards, so I'm a little worried. I don't really want to approach. I like, I like to react to the opponent. All right. Do, do I need to help here? I helped a bit. That's a club. Yeah, they left him with his club. Okay, there we go, I guess. Let me go, you bastards. You caused enough trouble. Give up a club quietly now. You know, but I bet you that guy is actually not a bad person, and the retainers are actually the bad people. Say, do you have business at the estate? Well, I guess I'll make it clear what my personal stakes are. My sister was kidnapped. Hmm, mm, your sister. Sorry to hear that. No doubt it's the work of the kidnappers plaguing Ahayama is like. We've been tracking the kidnappers, you know. Seems as though they're up to sight at the harbor. Trouble is, we've now got our hands full of this trailer. But the trailer is clearly an important character. He has very interesting sprite uh, portrait art. Mm. Look, if you want to help the captives, your harbor's your bet the best bet. Okay. Yeah, it's a really cool club, then. Huh. Harbor. Should be on the other side of the bridge. It's a shot in the dark, but it's all I got to work with. It's where I'll look for Yui. Okay. Kick. <laughs> oh, I'm actually allowed to explore. Oh no, I advanced time. That may have been a bad decision. Let's rush back to the harbor.
So if I see folks um, someone know this today, they're plot critical. Exactly. I wonder if it's like a certain number of screen transitions causes time to advance. I'm not really sure. Oh, who's this? Gamo. Hmm? What's going on? Oi. Official proclamation. Listen up. A festival is to be held in Minato three days hence. Potatoes will be on hand to supervise preparations. Follow orders and make sure the festival is a success. You are ordered to hold a festival! We will not... Uh, any resistance and you'll be held in contempt of court. Festivals are required. Mm -hmm. Hmm, I don't recall there being a festival this time of year before. Three days from now. The weather's been awful this past while. I hope the rain holds off. Oh, Kuro Shichi. Enough of the doom and gloom. Festivals are about forgetting your worries. Nice. You're right. A festival's nothing to grumble about, no matter how short notice. That's really weird. Short notice festival out of nowhere. As we all know, a festival means fireworks. Wait till you see what I got planned. See the fireworks guy. But the sound of it, they don't usually have festivals this time of year. I am as festival calendar is not my concern. I'll, I need to get to the harbor. Hmm. Also, Kanabo, Spiker studied to at a war club, used in feudal, feudal Japan by Samurai. Oh, neat! That is probably what it is. I did. Why go to all the trouble pulling a festival this time of the year? Oh. I think you'll find that's the whole point. The people need their distractions. Uh. Ah, so that's what you have in mind. I don't trust these two at all. People ought to be thankful their Lord Chamberlain takes such a keen interest in their well-being. Mm. Save the flattery. Is the palanquin ready? The palanquin? What is a palanquin? Of course, it's prepped and way in the estates. Should reach Minato by the evening of the festival. Mm. See that it does. I want to go to the festival. I also would like to go to a festival. It sounds nice. However, this is a festival that looks like it's covering up something bad. Like, ha! Get distracted, people. Ignore the terrible things happening. I agree. Time does advance rather quickly. And I like that we're on this one baseline for now. Probably for the first one, we just will be. What's up? Hey, bye. That's weird. I thought we were... I guess we were never that specific guy. If there's a green mark next to them, that means we've been them before, so to speak. Hmm. There's some words carved in the stone. Hydrangeas blush blue in the falling rain. Come night, those petals grow dark once again. This must be a song. I like the title Grand Robbers. Sounds so fancy <laughs> for a robber. And yeah, I could be talking to a few people here and there. Shadashi has got a bad for one of the new harlots. Oh, okay, that's good to know. I'm just focused on plot progression because I'm actually intrigued by the plot. Oh, who is this? Yuzu. Stop it, get away from me. Oh wait, is this another kidnapped? Yeah. <laughs> this one's got fire in her belly. Steady now, girl. It's for your own good. Hoda! What good's getting kidnapped going to do for me? Not in the listening mood, are you? If you ain't gonna come quiet like, perhaps you need persuaded. Nagatana, yes. Or Naganata, rather. Ooh, ooh. Oh, talk about perfect timing. Come on, give us a hand. Ah, you over there, you gotta help me! <coughs> Those are the kidnappers. Where'd you take the girl and give Yui back? I'm gonna save the girl, because I bet a lot of these guys don't know her name. Uh huh? Huh? Don't have a clue what you're talking about. Besides, I got my hands full of this little lassie. <coughs> Sound like a lot you're trying to give us orders. Don't think you can step on our toes, princess. Dude, you're just a junior bat, you're not even a grand bat. It they're on the moon to talk. If it's a fight they want, they'll have to oblige. I get the feeling of these dialogue options. I bet on a second playthrough, we get more of them. 
or we have to unlock more by learning things, right? We're very one track right now. Oh, you're blocking too, okay. okay go ahead. I think attacks are very good if used correctly. Oh, I wonder if they can counter me. I'm the one who found her. That girl is mine. Okay. Time loop game. Yeah. This is the tutorial loop. Thanks. I'm impressed. You know how to handle yourself. Where are my manners? I'm Izuyu. I guess I'm kind of the poster girl for this place. And this place is? A gambling den. You know, rolling dice, making money. Get some dangerous types in here. No place for decent folk, let's put it that way. Look, I'm sorry you got caught up in this. I'd love to replay the favor. Favor. Anything I could do? What kind of a person is the bad lady? There is something you can do. Oh, I don't like that last one. What does that mean? Uh, look for girls who we get at. Ah, you're asking the bads earlier, right? Did they take somebody you know? There's a time when honor among thieves meant something. The bandits used to ne never used to capture, kidnap people. Can't say the same these days. Makes you wonder what on earth happened to them. What kind of person's a bad leader? Uh... Honestly, I never met him. You think I told you just be here, say? Hey. Apparently, he doesn't show his face all too often. It's pretty proper among the townsfolk, mind you. People call him the. Eh. <laughs> there isn't a lock in the domain to keep him out. The what? <laughs> They will allow you to help traitor. I'm thinking so. I guess he never been caught because of that mask he wears. Keeps us didn't hit it. Oh, okay. The, by the way, I'd like to note the traitor guy has a mask, but the guy who killed us was also like the people who killed us was also led by a mask person. I don't think they were the same mask people. I think they're different mask people. Kid never are part of the. Also, he, is, she just said he's popular. The mask person. I think it's a different mask person that took us out. Kidnappers are part of the Kirikumo clan. Heard in secret they've been holding the captives lately at a warehouse by the harbor. To get there, you'd need to cross the bridge. Normally, there's a toll to pay. Yeah. But just tell them you're running an errand for me. They'll, let, they'll soon let you pass. <laughs> That's just between you and me, though. Can't keep getting away of all these kidnappings. I wish there was something I could do about it. Anyway, I hope you find what you're looking for. I'll say a prayer for you. She's nice. Gambling then, huh? Oh. So the men took Yui were bandits for the so-called Kirikumo clan. Izuyu told me the clan had been taking the captives to one of the harbor warehouses. It must be where Yui is. I need to go and save her. At the time we could probably use the errand excuse to cross sooner in the cycle. Probably, yeah. Yeah, I'm definitely seeing ways that this could be looping and you could have a different playthrough. I'm... I, f I feel like we don't have enough time to get through a full loop here on a Haller for an hour. We definitely don't. But I'll, I'll get through as much as I can for now. Would you guys like this to be another Hell? I feel like it should be. But I'd like to hear your guys' thoughts. The Highborn have been nothing to worry about in their old age. We commerce have to provide for ourselves. It's a very intriguing game. Nabuo. So whenever I see a name character, I'm intrigued. And this guy has unique art, too. You guys seem to be intrigued, too. Okay, cool. At least after the first loop. Yeah. Let's see how the second loop plays itself. So I guess we're carrying buckets of both hands. The next thing I knew, one of them was gone. They... You're very absent-minded, aren't you? Seems like a game I make could pick up myself. Yeah, this... This gave me really good vibes the moment I saw it. I was like, oh, wait, they, they're doing something... Special here. Also, again, for anybody joining late, this is partially developed or at least published by Acquire Core, who were the people responsible for the Tenchu Stealth Assassin games back on the PS1, as well as the Way of the Samurai games, both of which I played and loved. So this game feels like it is most definitely channeling the energy of those older Acquire Core games. So, Acquire Core being be involved in this project is a very good thing. Yes. Cross the bridge, pay the toll. 
Oh, I have to remember her name. <laughs> wait, wait. I'm running an errand for Kazuyu. That's wrong. I'm running an errand for Yuzuyu. That's correct. I'm running away from an errant Yuzuyu. <laughs> Let's do. Let's do the middle one though. <laughs> for Zuyu. All right, then off you go. Hold on, hold on. There's something funny about you. Hmm. If you're st if you're on air, and I'll have to let you pass. Dude, this job's draining the life out of me. If I let people go, it's the same result as if I take a break. I've been starving for a while too. I better get some food. <laughs> okay, never mind. I guess guardians for chumps. Yes. The Makuto is gone. That's all I need to pass over the bridge freely. Yeah, it's like we opened the bridge up here. Oh, see, that definitely makes sense. For you guys are right. On another loop. We can just tell him we're doing an errand. He's like, oh, okay, and then he leaves and he's not an issue anymore. So we can go to this area earlier in the game in future loops now. I see it. I think you always being held in the harbor warehouse. This explains a lot. Now I have to tell a friend who immediately purchased this. Do you have a friend that likes the Tenchu games or Way of Samurai? Might be worth checking where the harbor is. This is the map for the menu. Your current location next to check the target. Are all visible map icons? Icons differ depending on the type of event. Oh, okay. So we can actually see on uh, the map where events are. Ah, that's that's actually very good, especially with loops. The map shows your target destination. The icon arrow you know, indicating the direction ahead is the play of the HUD. Station icon to reach the destination. Okay. So like, if I open this up, we can see Minato has an event, and that is near the harbor. So, I guess we'll head that way. Yeah, alright. You go. Oh, I'm not growing vegetables just for the sake of those awful mutts. Uh, I wasn't accusing you of feeding vegetables to dogs, but I guess, okay. The Tinger games are really cool. Alright, I'll go a little bit longer. We do have other games, but I think if we're another Halloween, this I could put this one down pretty soon. Does the veggies too? They do. Yui. No, hallucinations. <laughs> Damn it! I lost sight of her. That was her. I'm sure of it. But she headed for the harbor. The warehouse. She must be in the warehouse. Oh, he's that guy. Oh, look! He has like a purple name. I guess because he's super important. Oh. Takes blood, sweat, and tears to put on a fire exit display. Always look for eager hands to help. Oh, I wonder if that the purple I wonder if that means that like I could do a side quest of the worst saying. Oh, hmm. uh, sure why what? I just hooked a big fish, but I escaped. Must have been the work of the spirits. Not wasn't the work of me. I, I am technically a spirit now, but it wasn't my fault. <laughs> yeah, if they have a special name, I think they're important. Oh. What's the dog doing? Yes, hey. What's the dog doing? <laughs> What the fuck's doing? Mm. Look at the dog. What's he doing? <laughs> what is that? What is that motion? Ah. Cezanne. You don't have anything sticky in mind, do you? I'm just gonna pay attention to name characters. Ah. Warehouse. I. They arrested. Some girls and also doggos. <laughs> Why is so many doggos? They also arrest girl doggos. They're arresting all the girls. <laughs> you get me out of here. Oh no, evil doggos. <laughs> Ujikane the dealer. Who the hell are you? How'd you find out about this place? Uh, the door was open and I wandered in. Great security, by the way. <laughs> Come on, you major curs. Tear this full of shreds. Evil black she being used. Oh no. <laughs> but they don't. Oh, they actually know how to guard. Shit. They're scarier than I thought. <laughs> oh my, your rage. Okay. That range is actually quite dangerous. 
Oh, dang, I was trying to block, but I was a little too slow. I can't just do normal text, but it definitely seems better to do combos. Oh my god! At least it's not hurting me that much, but... Damn, that range. What, what happened to the other dog? Hi. Oh, you're, are you running out of stamina? Okay. This dog is just eternally guarding. Interesting. Defensive doggo. I feel like the dogs are mostly here to distract me. Oh shit, a counter- Oh, he stood up with a counter attack, goddamn. Try to play it safe. Ah, fuck. That reach is so reachy. <laughs> Oh, there, there it is, finally. I was wondering why a dog would actually try to attack me. Yeah, it's hard. You can't just run past his attack. Oh no, I ran into his attack! <laughs> That's even worse! Doggo, stop blocking, doggo! <laughs> stop blocking, doggo! Damn, those useless curse! You you fell before your useless curse! Oh, two levels. <laughs> I'm trying to play it safe! Right Stra straight forward next to me, not blocking. I mean, come on! <laughs> safe is a. It's a very, it's a very subjective term. <laughs> Thanks, I appreciate it. The Kurikuma clan kidnapped us and locked us up. By the way, the boss music is really solid, like a lot. Make this boss music, by the way, is exactly what you hear in Tenchu when you're fighting bosses in the Tenchu games. That is basically Tenchu music. I like it. <laughs> by the way, Tenchu has really good boss fights too. <laughs> Honestly, some of them are kind of bullshit, but they're they're still fun. Um. What does the Kurikuma clan want? Oh, actually, no, let's ask if we've seen a girl who can't speak. A mute lassie? A mute lassie! Sorry, that doesn't ring any bells. Ah, oh, but I heard the bad's looking for someone. The kidnapping young girls left, right, and cinder. The young lassie's who they're after. Maybe they took her to the castle ruins. That's where they're holed up. They what? I'm the Foggus. Never used to be in the business of kidnapping folk, though. I'm really glad time doesn't progress in battle, but instead air turns I agree! I don't mind a time-based system. I don't mind a time-based system where you can you have to like choose your events and then, you know, time advances and some stuff stops being around. I don't I actually think that's very interesting, but I hate it when it's done by actual passage of time. Where it's like, oh shoot, should I go to the restaurant? Well, if I go to the restaurant that takes like five minutes. I might miss an event. I hate that. It makes me stress out. But if it's it's based on area transitions, then I can plan it out, right? I'm going to like, well, okay, we're going to go. It's going to advance time when we go through here. So I'll go through here when I feel like it and advance time. Like, it's a much better system for me. I much I find that much more... Because it's, it's about planning. It's not about actually, like, trying to rush. It's about making sure to plan where you're going. And that's... I like that. Yeah. Anyways, judging from what the bandits have been saying, the order is coming from the chief himself. Kirikumo. Does Kirikumo fell wear a mask? Can't rightly say. Never see him. For all I know, he might do. Listen, we gotta make ourselves scarce before any of those bandits show their faces. I can't thank you enough. We won't forget this. Off they go. I felt so sure you would be here. Because I'm sure that there are situations where there's going to be multiple events and I can go do one, but then that makes the other ones go away because time advances, right? Or one reason or another. And that's good, because if it's a multiple choice game, there should be that system. But if that system was based purely on actual time passing as I play, it'd be very frustrating. You'd have to really optimize where you're going. But this system, you could spend all the time you want thinking about where to go and then just make that decision when you're ready. I'd much, I find that much more relaxing. Yeah, you need to be able to control the flow of time to degree. Yes, I agree, Astor. Though there are there are time loop games that don't do that. There was this one PS2 game 
Oh, geez. What was that? What, it was a Groundhog Day game for the PS2. It was an RPG. You had musical instruments. Uh, what was it called? I really liked it, but time actually did move as time passed. And it was so rough to get anything done because you could just just get a little turned around, get lost in the city. It was a very big city. And then, like, you just missed an event because you, you took too long. And it it kind of sucked. I'm going to try to remember... Yeah, Ephemeral Fantasia. I wonder if anybody has actually played this besides me. I'll show you guys. I thought it was a very interesting game, but it was extremely flawed. Its execution did not quite land. Very interesting game, but... If you're, if you're ever curious about some old RPG you haven't played, this is a good... It's, good to, it's a good one to look at. It's not perfect, but it's interesting. Wish I had a mod where, it could, where you, they could... I wish it got modded or something by somebody, uh, some sort of hack that makes the time system more forgiving. But anyways, maybe she's been kidnapped by bandits and taken to the castle ruins the clan are holed up in. If I chase after them now, I should make it. And maybe you would. I could be a dog. I could be a watchdog, but that's not very good stats. <laughs> Oh, oh no, I see one problem with this game. If I kill everybody in a clump like this, it becomes difficult to, uh... I can't look at the dealer. <laughs> Hold on, I, I, think I, I think I have to, like, actually shift to move some bodies around. <laughs> Popo. Okay, now I've shifted him. Actually, it's good I shall shift anyways, because now I've unlocked the watchdog. I've shifted into them, so now I, I can I know them. Uh, so let's see, how does he compare to? So the, so the robber has more attack stats, but like, my god, the reach of this spear. It's probably a bit slower though. But yeah, this guy looks superior to play as. Um, overall, at least, much higher defense. Way higher defense than HP. Oh wait. Uh, yeah. This this seems. Hold on. Wait. So what is the second? That's his focus. Yeah, less focus. A little less focus, a little less attack, but not by much. So. All right. I think this is a good stopping point. I'm gonna go put myself in jail and uh, quit here. <laughs> uh, let's save. This is a lot of fun. This will be another held. I can't tell you what day we're going to be playing, but expect it in a week to two weeks. I will cover it with, I will get back to this within two weeks. Uh, I can say that much for sure. This is very cool. Um, th this is everything I was hoping it would be, actually. I like this a lot. Amidama. This just released, as is typical for games that I usually cover on Halo for an hour. Check this one out. Honestly... If you like Tenshu Stealth Assassins or Way of Samurai games, this has definitely the same vibes. It's a little bit different on, on like genre and gameplay, but like, oh yeah, this is this is solid. Um, the price of it, by the way, for those wondering, looks to be twenty two forty nine USD. Currently on sale for ten percent off. Normally, clocks in a little bit more than that, twenty five bucks, I guess. So it's a little bit pricey, but if it does have the content value that I think it will given the loop system that will probably be in play, well, almost certainly in play. I think there's a lot to be had here. Plus, it's also a sandbox, so you just go, you could just go around probably slashing people up without worrying about the story if you wanted to. Uh, but yeah, Amidama, this is... I'm really glad this game ended up being as good of an experience as I was hoping it'd be, because it's nice to see one of these style games, these sort of samurai sandboxy games. You don't see them much these days. They're kind of an old breed. So it's nice to see a new one release. But that was Amidama, and we'll come back to this in a week or two.